going on everybody it is the mouth of the south here and as you can probably see in the background i am watching wwe friday night smackdown live of course it is the wwe draft now i'm uploading a quick video and my thoughts on a recent draft pick now the friday night smackdown it opened up with seth rollins versus roman reigns and in the match seth rollins was attacked by the fiend Fiend got massive cheers, he dragged him under the ring with a mandible claw. Seth uh, escaped from underneath the ring, Bray popped his head up to scare uh, Rollins again and then disappeared, uh, appeared again at the top of the ramp and then pff, gone. And then he got drafted to SmackDown. This is good. This is bad. It is bad because what was the point in having The Fiend go after Seth Rollins again if literally two minutes later you're going to draft him to SmackDown? What was the point in that? If you're not going to continue the food, what the, the Fiend feud, this prick will t learn how to talk in a second. Ex fucking excuse me. But how are you going to have him attack Seth Rollins and then immediately draft him? To a separate brand. That makes no sense. That's stupid. Kind of what was the point? Was it just to kind of go. Look we haven't forgotten about what happened at Hell in the Cell. You still like The Fiend right? Which yeah of course we do. And weirdly enough Seth Rollins didn't get absolutely boo to shit. Which I thought he would. I'm glad he didn't. Because it's not Seth's fault. About the main event. Being as bad as it was. It's the writer's fault. Don't blame Bray. Don't blame Seth. Blame Seth. Fuck. I will learn how to talk eventually. We'll see. Um, but why I think this is great. We're going to get The Fiend versus The Undertaker at Survivor Series. So a few weeks back uh, on the Raw Celebration show or yeah, I think it was the Raw Celebration where you had a uh, Stone Cold on and uh, a few others. Uh, one of Bray's puppets, I, can't, I think it was Rampin' Rabbit, Ramblin' Rabbit, I think, or maybe it was Abby. Their clock <clears throat> was stuck on the numbers 1119. Now, a lot of people took this to mean Bible verses, and they were looking into Bible verses for it. If you do your research, you find out that Undertaker debuted on the 19th of November at Survivor Series. And obviously, that date written in American is 11-19. The Undertaker is mostly known as a Smackdown guy. Where has Bray just been drafted to? I'm calling it now. I've been saying it since the 11-19 thing. We are going to see The Fiend versus The Undertaker. The Undertaker will go out on his back, passing the spooky character, you know, passing it down to Wyatt. He would do I'm I'm calling it. It's gonna happen. The Undertaker is gonna hand down the mantle and the moniker of the spooky evil guy in WWE, which he's held for years and years and years. He is gonna pass that down to the fiend. And the fiend will beat the Undertaker clean. He will go out in November at Survivor Series the pay-per-view he debuted at, at 11.19, as showed on the clock in Firefly Funhouse. I'm calling it. It's going to happen. It, it It's happening. Get hyped, is all I'm going to say. If it doesn't happen, what the fuck? Why not? But you heard it here first. Well, you probably didn't hear it here first, because, you know, it's just a theory that's been floating around. But ever since I saw the 1119 thing, I was calling it. And then when they ended him, and then when they were doing the whole Seth Rollins thing, I was wondering if it was going to be for a title. But now they've drafted him to SmackDown. I believe last time we saw Undertaker, it was on a SmackDown branded pay-per-view. Or it was for, yeah, it was for SmackDown because he was teaming with, with Roman Reigns. So it was a SmackDown thing, right? I'm sure of it. 
Either way, Undertaker is known as a SmackDown guy. Ray's been moved to SmackDown. They're both creepy dudes. Undertaker's an old dude, you know, legend. He will go out using that. You go out on your back, passing the mantle down to the next person in line. Passing the spooky torch to Bray fucking Wyatt. To the Fiend. Brilliant. Love it. It's amazing. The Fiend vs. The Undertaker. Survivor Series. It's happening. I Stay sick everyone. Please like, share, subscribe. And uh, do some naughty things down in the comments. Alright, I'm out.